Welcome to the DevExpress Learn Now series, a set of quick tutorials to help you get started with DevExpress controls. In this video, we'll handle the button click event of the grid's embedded navigator and add code that'll give the user a pop-up to confirm deletion of a specific row. So let's get started. Here we have a grid control bound to some data from the sample Northwind database. We first need to add the embedded navigator by setting the use embedded navigator property to true. You'll notice the navigator appears on our form. I'll run the app to show you that by default, records are deleted immediately and without warning. This can be bad for an end user who accidentally erases a record they needed. Let's go back now and add some code that'll give us a pop-up warning for every deletion. To do this, let's handle the button click event for our embedded navigator. I'll select the grid control and from the events list, open the embedded navigator section and double click on the button click event. Since the navigator is part of our editor's library, I'll first need to add a reference to the following namespace. Then I add the following code to the event handler. Since the button click event is raised when any of the buttons are clicked, I'm going to check specifically for the navigator button type, remove. Then the confirmation dialog is displayed. If the user clicks yes, then the handled property is set to true so that the default processing is applied. If the answer is no or cancel, then no default processing occurs, leaving our record undeleted. And that's it. Let's run the application and see our results. This time, when I select the row and choose to delete it, I'm presented with my pop-up window asking me for confirmation. When I click yes, the selection is deleted. But let's say I've selected a row and want to keep it. I choose no and my record remains intact. Thanks for watching. Let's see what develops.